I am proud to announce that after much hard work on the part of me and my husband, Hi. Carrie Cutsworth and me, um, we have finished the Veggie Beauty website. I've been talking to you guys about that for a couple months now. Um, it's been it's been quite a process. We built it ourselves, and we didn't hire anyone else to build it for us. So all the work was done by me and my husband. Um, I wrote the content, and he helped design it and put it together and worked his WordPress magic. Um, do you kind of want to explain like what WordPress is, Carrie? A lot of people don't know what that is. Sure, Christy. I'd be glad to. <laughs> uh, WordPress. <laughs> You're acting like around like a Saturday morning cartoon special or something. Yeah, I know. That's how I'm going to do these from now on. Okay. <laughs> um, WordPress is a content management system. And what that means is it um, basically provides like a back end to a website or blog. It keeps track of all your posts and organizes everything for you. Or um, if you're using it to build a website, it's handy for uh, managing your pages or a portfolio or pretty much any kind of website, really. And you can use it to set up a shop, too. Um, gives you a lot more control over your blog than a, a standard blog spot, a blogger blog will, because you can break things up into categories and you can control like, the structure of the site, you can kind of make it into a more user-friendly experience. And also, you can, you can edit the content really easily too, just like you can in Blogger. It's not really any more difficult than using Blogger or Facebook to create a post. You know, I used to build websites with HTML, but you know, it was very, very basic stuff and I would have no idea how to put together something like this, but um, really, like, the way it works is that he has access to, like, the designer parts of the website, so you can't really mess that up. He has, like, access to, like, that kind of stuff, but I get to add pages and research and update things. Like, I can update my homepage, I can update the slides in the homepage, I have access to updating it. So if I ever wanted to make any like design changes, that's where he would come in. And that's what that's how we built it together. And you can add pictures and songs and mm -hmm. video and, video. and all those kinds of things to it. I was able to add all of my YouTube videos. Um, they're actually categorized. So if you are looking for a specific kind of video, I do have categories listed on there. So it should be easier to find. Um, I have all my blog posts from Blogspot on there and they're tagged and categorized, so if you're looking for a recipe, if you're looking for specific posts that I did a while back, they're all on there. Um, they can be searched, too, with yeah, search bars on there. You can search the website for anything you're looking for. Um, I do have my cruelty-free list on there. It is as updated as it has ever been. Um, I am going to continue to update, of course, as I get more cruelty-free statements. What's going to be new about the site as opposed to just my channel, I have limitations with the amount of um, space on the, the sidebar of my channel, which is why I'm not having my list on there anymore. I'm moving it to my website so I can have more control over it. Um, I do have things listed by categories, so like face products, skincare, um, nail polish, household cleaners, that kind of thing. So you guys can easily find what you're looking for on there. So there will be a link on there instead of the full list on my sidebar. There will be a link to my, my page, my website with the list. So I hope that's okay with you guys. Um, and if you do copy the list and use it, that's totally fine. Just make sure to credit me, um, maybe link back to my site or to my YouTube channel just so um, people know where you got the list from. And make sure to update too. If you, if you use my list, just check back. Sometimes things change. Sometimes companies buy out different companies or learn new information. So um, just make sure to check back if you are using my list because that is just the nature of cruelty-free research. Things change all of the time and I learn new information from companies all the time. Like just today I got like four new emails from companies so I added some new companies on there. And the nice thing is I'm able to include all of the statements that companies send me on the website. So there's a section for cruelty free statements from companies and then there's a section on um, vegan products like vegan skincare, vegan stuff like that. So um, I am having um, a section on there if you are a vegan and you only want to use vegan products. Um, I do have vegan companies listed separately on my cruelty free list now so if you just want to support uh, vegan companies I have them listed on there um, and of course if you guys have any research you want to share with me um, email me at veggiebeautycosmetics at gmail.com I will credit you if you want just let me know in the email if you want credit for the information I will put that on my webpage um, I couldn't do this without all of you guys so I just I want to thank you so much for helping me with all the research and 
I am really proud of my website and it's going to be a work in progress and it's, it's really exciting. And I am able to sell my stuff on there too. I'm able to sell my artwork and my purses through there. I don't have to charge more like I would on Etsy because of the fees. It's all through me. It's all my own independent business so I can do what I want. So that's really nice that I have control over that. Um, so yeah, anything you want to add, Carrie, about my website? Um, just that also with WordPress, it helps to keep your theme really consistent on your website too. The visual appearance of it doesn't have to change as much as if you're using standard HTML and uh, CSS websites. I mean, it still creates those elements of HTML and CSS, but it does it dynamically. So that way you can add content, but it won't break the design of the site. It's really exciting. And I am able to sell my stuff on there too. I'm able to sell my artwork and my purses through there. I don't have to charge more like I would on Etsy because of the fees. It's all through me. It's all my own independent business, so I can do what I want. So that's really nice that I have control over that. Um, so yeah, anything you want to add, Carrie, about my website? Um, just that also with WordPress, it helps to keep your theme really consistent on your website too. The visual appearance of it doesn't have to change as much as if you're using standard HTML and uh, CSS websites. I mean, it still creates those elements of HTML and CSS, but it does it dynamically, so that way you can add content, but it won't break the design of the site, which is an issue with a lot of older sites. Right, so essentially that means like, <coughs> excuse me, I'm trying to throw up. Essentially what that means is that you can add content without messing up your website, essentially, right? That's what you're saying? Yeah, I mean, it'll stay consistent. I'm currently looking to create more websites and do some work in that area. So um, if anybody is interested in uh, working with me to build a site or something, just uh, please contact me. I think Christy's mm -hmm. going to put a link down below here. Yeah. But um, yeah, I'm interested in doing some work right now. So He's building his portfolio, and any, um, any freelance work he can get really does help him. Um, what kind of prices would you charge for like a website like mine, just in case people were wondering? Probably around $500 for the thing to do everything that we've done mm -hmm. for you. Um, do you want to explain like how you break down the price just so people know? Like it sounds like a lot of money like up front and people think it is but think of how long we worked on this. Like my site took about two months right and that was us yeah. working together so it would take him more time to do everything himself and to you know in input all that information, make all the pages, um, design everything. Like he does everything so that's where that price comes from and that's actually a really reasonable price if you're doing like a full on website as opposed to like a blogspot blog where you know they do all the coding for you but you don't have a lot of control over your links or your information you can't customize it at all you can't you can't if you have a store you can't sell things through it i mean there's a lot of limitations to just using a blogspot blog so if you are um looking into being an independent business owner or just furthering your YouTube career, you might want to check out making your own website. It is not as hard as you think it is. It really isn't. And um, I I could even build it with him. Like, it's it's not that difficult. Yeah, and smaller projects I would charge less for, too. If it's right. It depends on the kind of features. It's all YouTube videos. It, it pretty much automatically imports it whenever she makes one. Yeah. It automatically shows our most recent posts on her homepage. And it has a shopping cart in it too, and it's got um, slideshow. It has quite a few um, sort of higher end features that plugins. And stuff. Yeah, plugins and things mm -hmm. that you have to customize and get to work. And uh, yeah, so and he and he um, designed like my home page is very um, custom. Like we built it together. Like I did the drawings for it, and he he built the paper collaging and that kind of thing. You want to explain that? I mean. So I took some uh, textures I found online, different paper samples, and then I used a um, Photoshop thing to make the torn paper edges, kind of some different brush effects, and then after that, um, some lighting and different things, and then that's when we were there, you know? Mm -hmm. And uh, then I took Christie's drawings and cut them out and added them to the paper texture. I am available for commissions as well, so if you are looking for someone to make drawings for your website or you want to um, commission a watercolor painting, purses, shoes, anything like that, you can contact me um, through my website. I do have a store on there. And right now you can also subscribe through the WordPress site. 
So basically you can uh, be notified whenever Christy enters a new post, I think is how that will run. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just, I'm really proud of like the website. Like it's my little baby, so I'm like really <laughs> proud of it right now. Like I'm able to link to all the companies now too. So it's not just a list, like I do, you, they are linked to companies. So if you're looking to buy that product, all you have to do is click on it and you can go to that company. So I hope that helps you guys. And I really did have a good time making this for you. I'm going to continue to update it. If you guys could go check it out and just let me know what you think of it. I am very proud of it. Um, if there's anything you'd like to see on the site, if there, you know, is any improvements you think I should make, just let me know. Um, I am making this for, for everybody and um, it does cost money to to run a website so I do have a donate button if you want to donate to help me keep the site running um, it costs money to keep it online that kind of thing um, I'm not asking to do that you don't have to but that is an option if you want to help my research because it does take a lot of time it's a lot of effort and it does take a lot of money so um, if you want to help out there's a donate button um, through PayPal on there. You can check that out on the homepage. And yeah, I really do hope you guys like having the website. I know I've had a lot of requests for it. And so um, I knew it was important to have it out there to have control over my own cruelty free list um, and, to, and to have proof of like cruelty free statements, um, to have vegan makeup lists, all that stuff for you guys. So I really hope this helps. And yeah, thanks for checking out my new website. And thanks, Carrie, for helping build it. You're welcome. Alright, let us know if you have any questions about anything, and if you wanted to um, hire Carrie to create a website for you, we're not pushing you on it at all, but he is available for freelance work right now, so. So if you like what you see, let us know. Yeah, definitely. Alright, thanks guys, bye.